Everyone, and thank you so much for tuning in at this historic event in the life of our church. My name is Father Nicholas Lowe, and today, on this August 29th, 2020, we are elevating the cross above our main dome at our new church location right here at Beach Boulevard. To those of you that may not be part of the St. John the Divine family, we just wanted to thank you uh, for tuning in and supporting us, and we ask that you continue to pray for us. If you are uh, searching for a church and you live in the city of Jacksonville, we always welcome you to come and worship with us as well. And to our church family, to those of you that are tuning in, um, whether it be through Facebook Live or if you're downloading this message, I just can't tell you how grateful I am for all of you. Uh, this is not what we had typically had hoped to do. Uh, this event, we would have had all of you here present, but obviously with COVID, um, things have kind of changed, but it's all right, we're gonna get through this. But I do want all of you to know that a part of our church family, thank you. We could not be where we are as a church today without your support, not only in the present, but those who have gone before us in the past. So God bless you. And I, my prayer is for everyone that's in the city of Jacksonville, for our church family, those that are inside the walls of our church and those that are outside the walls of our church, that when they see the crosses that are above the stone, that if they're in a state of hopelessness, that they're gonna be hopeful. If they're in a state of sorrow, that'll be a state of joy. That when they see this cross, that if they are going through any type of difficult times, that they'll remi be reminded always that light always triumphs over darkness. God bless you, and please join us now as we say a special prayer over the cross that will be over the dome. May God be gracious upon us and have mercy upon us sinners. May God be gracious upon us sinners and have mercy upon us. May God be gracious upon us sinners and have mercy upon us. Blessed is our God always, now and forever, into the ages of ages. Amen. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever, into the ages of ages. Amen. All Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, be gracious upon our sins. Master, pardon our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for your namesake. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Oh, Heavenly Father, you are the author of the human race. You are the giver of all spiritual graces. You are the bestower of eternal salvation. Do you the same, loving Lord, send down your Holy Spirit, Lord. And with a blessing from on high, to now bless this holy cross that will now stand tall above the dome of our holy church of St. John the Divine. We pray that this cross will be a beacon of hope to all those who are afflicted, that it may be a source of comfort to all those who are struggling, may be a source of love to all those who are feeling lonely. And may this cross symbolize our Savior's triumph over death, through Jesus Christ, our Lord, who died on the cross to grant us eternal life in his kingdom. In the name of the Father, and of your all holy, good, and life-giving spirit, both now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Son, son, kiri et on laon su, kevlo yi son, tin su, Nikasis Vasilevsi Katavar Varon Dorumenos Ketos Son Filaton Thea to Stavrusopolitevma Save, O God, your people and bless your inheritance. Grand victory to your faithful against the adversaries of the faith, and protect your people by the power of the cross. 
Save, O Lord, your people, and bless your inheritance. Grant victory to the faithful against the adversaries of the faith, and protect your people by the power of your cross. Apostle Christo to Theu Igapimene, Epitaki non rise, Laona apologiton, Decetese prospitonta, O epipesonta, Tostithicata dexamenos, Onicete vete o loge, Que pimo non nefos et non dias que dase, Et tu menos imin irinin que to megae, O Apostle John, the beloved of Christ our God, hasten to deliver us a people that have no excuse. He accepts your supplicating to him, for our Lord condescended at the Last Supper to let you lean upon him. We ask you to entreat, O Saint John the Theologian, that he scatter the persistent cloud of hostile nations and pray for us for peace and great mercy. Glory to you, God, you are hope. Glory to you. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Holy Father, give the blessing. May Christ, our true God, as a good, loving, and merciful God, may have mercy upon us and save us. Through the prayers of his most pure, holy, and ever-Virgin Mary, the Panagia and Mother of our God, through the prayers of the holy, bodiless powers of God, the holy angels, through the prayers and supplication of the honorable, glorious, and final prophet, St. John the Baptist, through the prayers of the holy apostles of our faith, the holy fathers and mothers of our faith, through the holy martyrs who died for our Christian faith, and through the prayers of St. John the Divine, the patron saint of this holy church, and of all of the saints, Lord, we ask that you have mercy upon us and save us. Through the prayers of our holy fathers, O Lord Jesus Christ, have mercy upon us and save us. May the blessings of our Lord God and Savior Jesus Christ be with all of you. Father Milton. Save, O Lord, your people, and bless.